I don't know which one to take. Hey y'all, just some kayak catfish. What a morning I have had. I got on the water this morning about dawn and I got anchored down in a creek mouth. And this area I was fishing, it was a lot more shallow than what I normally fish. And I was hoping to do that to get on some flatheads today. And boy did I, I got four nice flatheads just right away. Just boom, 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 right away. And I had a little lull in the action. And then I got a big blue cat. And then unfortunately after that, the wind kicked up. And that's why I'm filming this intro slash closing here at the house after I got home because I just couldn't do it out there on the water. The, the wind was blowing across the channel and it was overriding the current and it, I just couldn't stay anchored in it. It just kept blowing me up on the ledge there. And so I had to call it a day early. But before that happened, I got on some good fish. I was using cut bait today. I'd hope to get some live bluegill uh, to throw out there too, but I, was, I got out there on the water right at dawn and I didn't want to waste any time catching any live bait. So I went out last night and I'd got some crappie, I got some bluegill, and so that's what I was using for bait today, just cutting those up in chunks. Had them suspended about two to three feet off the bottom. And like I said, it was a fun day. Here's the action. Feels like a decent fish on. That's a decent fish right there. He's digging. It's a little piece of crappie. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he's digging. He kind of acted like a flathead the way he hit it. Still ain't rolling, so I'm assuming it probably is a flathead. Strip some drag now. There we go. Where goes that one too? Goodness, buddy. Goodness. Get rod. Get rod. There goes that one. Anchor down just a few minutes. We're already getting started. Another rod up there got hit too. Oh, yeah, that's a flatty. I thought it was a flathead the way he hit it. Let's hope I get my bait back on this too. <laughs> That's a good way to get the morning started right there, buddy. Been on the water just a few minutes. We already hooked up with this thing. I'll stick him on the board. We'll just get a little quick length on him. He ain't too terribly long. But we'll check him out anyway. Yeah, he's about 32 inches. Still, that's a good flathead. <laughs> nice way to get it going. Let's let him go. See you, buddy. There you go. Let's get that bait back down there. Wait on that. on him. See his tail there, got that black spot on it. That's a cool looking fish. I'll get some action right here. Um, right here at this creek mouth where it dumps the animal in a shallower section of the river here. I'm in 22 feet of water today. But you know, we're in, the, in this time of year, spring, these fish are really getting active and they're moving up river. Let's let him go. 
See you, buddy. <laughs> He's coming. A little bit of white on there. I bet you that's a little flathead. My line's moving right there. Let's see if I won't let him take off with it. That's a big bait. I want him to eat it. He's got it. He's got it. Oh, goodness. That's another solid fish. <laughs> there he goes. He's digging, buddy. He's digging. He's been some hard pulling fish this morning, y'all. The other thing about where I'm fishing today is I'm suspend fishing right now because the current's light. That rod got hit too. Um, if the current picks up, I may have to cast my baits out. But right now. Because I'm suspend fishing and I'm in 22 feet of water, my that rod's going down too. I can't tell if this fish has just got my line or if I got another fish in it. But, uh, guys, I'm gonna pick up on that. I think that's another fish. That's another fish. That's another one right there. This will not be bigger than the other one. Like I was saying, it's hard to tell because yeah, they're both big. They're both digging. <laughs> I don't know which one to take. But when you're in 22 feet of water, you know, I got 20 foot of line out when they hit, so <laughs> it's intense. It's an intense battle. And they both may have each other, too. So another problem. <laughs> they may be wrapped up in each other. Golly. <laughs> Man, they're pulling strong today. These are some hard pulling fish, buddy. Every fish I've caught hit the crappie. I've got a skipjack head on the other rod up there. But it's old. Uh, it's been it's the bottom of my emergency stash in the freezer, so it's probably two years old. This crappie that I caught all these fish on so far is fresh. I caught it last night. Man, that is a strong fish, buddy. That is a strong fish. <laughs> Look at the bend in that rod. I don't know if you can see it on the camera angle. Oh, this one ate a chunk of crappie. The other one there is a head. Guys, this is just a, like I said, it's a small creek. It's not really a small creek. It's very long, but it's not very deep. It's not a very deep creek. It's not a very wide creek, but it dumps into the main river channel here, and this section of the river is shallow. It's a shallow section. And if we can pull him up. Get a first look at him. Look at that beast right there, buddy. That's a good one. Let's get this first one in. Look at that flathead right there, buddy. Look at that. Look at that. I got another one on. My lines are tangled all to hell. But there's another one down there on that other line. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that, buddy. Wow. That's a good fish, buddy. He put a he put a hurting on me. <laughs> These sacks are strong. Look at that. Wow. That is a fat flathead. He's been eating good. Whew. And I still got that other one on down there too. I'm gonna throw him on this board here. We'll get a length on him. All right, guys. Let's get one more look at him here. That fish is 39 inches. That's a good flathead. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna let him go. I'm gonna get a 
at least shot on him here. Let's say goodbye. Oh, there he goes. Now let's land this other one. <laughs> a tangled mess with my lines. Jeez. My dang lines, them two fish have gotten down there and just swam around each other. I'm going to have to pull him in by hand. <laughs> I'm going to have to, I'm pulling this one in by hand, y'all. It's another good one. It's another real good one. This may be bigger than the other one. <laughs> oh, there he is. Look at this one. Hell, I think this one might be bigger than the other one. <laughs> to pull that fish in by hand. <laughs> My lines are so tangled up, I couldn't reel that other one in. <laughs> Look at this one. <laughs> Look at that. Man. You talk about some strong fish, buddy. My arm's tired. <laughs> Look at that. Let's throw this in on the board too and just see what we got here. All right, guys. One more look at him there. That one right there is just a shade under 40 inches long and fat. <laughs> All right. I'm going to let this one go and I'm going to have to cut my lines and start over there, but I want to get baited up again and see if we can get some more. All right. I'll buy a flathead number two. Take off for me. There he goes. See ya, buddy. You were fun. Man, how awesome was that? <laughs> Look at that, buddy. Look at that. Look at that. Jeez. Man. And he's pulling. Is he on there or did he come off? Please don't tell me to come off. He's on there, he's coming in. That's gotta be a striper. That's gotta be a striper. He was swimming too fast. Too fast in each direction. <laughs> well, he was pulling, wasn't he? <laughs> Couldn't get the rod out of the rod holder. Drag was stripping. Gotta be a striper. No, it's a blue. Holy cow. Man. And he ain't even that big. <laughs> Man, I thought for sure I had a striper on there. Landing this fish a little too soon, a little too green. I'm trying to get my, my crappie head back. I'll tell you what, buddy, that was an odd fight for a blue cat. He hit that thing full steam going downstream and then turned. And I thought I'd lost him for a second. I had to reel down and catch up with him because he was coming full speed right back at me. And this thing, I mean, he's a decent fish here but to swim like that <laughs> that was not what I expected I thought for sure I had a striper on he acted just like a striper <laughs> let me just throw him on the board too here he's a, not a fat fish but he's a long one that fish if I bend the tail it makes him 34 inches but, uh, good fish but man <laughs> He crushed that bait. I mean, absolutely crushed it. <laughs> well, let's let him go. See the blue cat. <laughs> I almost wish he'd come off so I'd had a story of a big one that got away. <laughs> All right, y'all, I don't know how well you can hear me right now. I'm gonna try to do this closing in between wind gusts. 
It has picked up something terrible out here. You probably see the flag blowing behind me. It's blowing across the channel, so it's not creating a lot of chop on the water, but I just cannot stay anchored. The current's going this way, and the wind keeps pushing me this way, and it keeps pushing me up on this ledge, and it's just days over, man. I just can't fight this. So, uh, hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next one.